Frick. Frick, 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 frick. I freaking can't believe I have to struggle eating with a cap tooth in my mouth. All because of the huge cavity that I had. Oh, not just that, but even worse. Dad grounded me because of it. That's it, I will kick the TV. Rawr. There you go stupid TV. You run extremely slow anyway for me whenever I watch YouTube on it. What the f were you doing in my f***ing living room? You badass better tell me the goddamn truth right now, or else I will pick you up and throw you out of the window in your room. You got five seconds to talk. Five, four, three. <laughs> alright, alright, it's tremendously over now. So, what I did was, I kicked the TV screen, because I was very upset that I'm struggling to eat chopped food with a capped tooth. That's the reason why I'm sort of losing weight, because I can't eat certain amount of foods with a cap tooth I recently got. I am so sorry I broke your huge TV. Please don't whoop me. Oh, 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 Lou. Okay, Lou. Shoot, I meant, classic K. Lou, how dare you kick my TV and break it. That cost $700. And that was a Samsung 65-inch 4K, 2024 QLED TV, with 120Hz and 120FPS. Now I must go to the TV store and buy another one from BJ's, or perhaps Walmart, and I highly do but it'll be better than the other one you broke. I'm thinking it's gonna be so slow that it's gonna be a crappy Vizio 24-inch T-Series 720p TV, which is super slow, with a crappy 60Hz and 60FPS. In this house. We are a fan of 120 Hz and 120 frames per second. 60 Hz and 60 FPS is very crappy in our opinions. If I can't afford a good TV more than $100, it's all of your fault and I will whoop your ass so hard with a good belt. Anyway, you are grounded for 3 months. That's until late August. Go to your room, right now, and honestly, think about what you did in your brain recently related to this mess while I finish this TV up so good. Upstairs now. Go! <laughs> uh...